the uh, first game for the club. Um, tell us how you felt. Yeah, it felt good to get out there um, and just just get run back in the legs. Um, you know, try and get that match fitness um, back into myself. So um, no, it was good. I really enjoyed it out there and um, looking forward to getting back out there next week. Good battle against uh, Sandlands. A big unit, isn't he? Yeah, he's a massive, massive player, and um, you know, it's always tough coming up against him. Um, a bit unfortunate that Loeb's, um got pulled out before the game, but um, wouldn't have wanted his help out there. But uh, yeah, you just go out there and just you know you just got to give your best against blokes like him. Um, you know, he's a monster. Tell us, uh, pretty special before the game receiving your, your number four guarantee from Gavin Wanganui. Yeah, I was pretty nervous actually. Um, yeah, but a just awesome moment to you know. Um, be given a present a jumper by Gav. Um, you know, everyone knows knows um, how special he is. So um, yeah, that was that was really good. We uh, fell narrowly short against uh, Freo. What did Kenny say after the game? What were the keys to um, I guess why we didn't quite get over the line? Um, pro probably just they were probably a bit better um, around the ball than us. Um, and then going forward, they probably um, took the most of their chances and. Um, we we'll probably let, let a couple, couple slip, so um, it was a very winnable game for us and you know, disappointing to come away without the loss, but um, without the win. But um, you know, um, the boys still played pretty well and, and gave everything. And how did you find the, uh, the midfield group? Um, Centre worked pretty well yesterday? Yeah, yeah. Um, it's it's going to get, you know, it'll get better as the season progresses. Um, once I you know, get to play more matches with blokes like Robbie and and Trav and, and Ollie and um, I really really get to know how they how they play the game and stuff. So um, it's only going to be, um, get better. A lot of people were saying it was finals like intensity um, out there at the at Subiaco. Um, is that what it felt like? I haven't really played too much finals, but um, yeah, it, it was it was really really um, the pressure was on, um, and both teams were going hard at it. So. Um, I'd suspect that that's what finals footy is about, so um, yeah, it was, it was a really good game um, first up. And uh, Sydney this week, um, come up against, uh, I guess, a potential combination of Tippett and um, Pike. How do we go about preparing ourselves for Sydney? Uh, yeah, we we'll, myself and Loeb's will sit down with um, Greasy during the week and you know, come up with the best plan to, to attack those guys. And um, you know, they, We won't have Sandlands out there, so I reckon you know, we might be able to get, get our hands on the ball a bit more. So. Um, you know, provide, provide that use to the to the midfielders and um, get going from there. And just finally, um, your first shot at playing on, uh, or second shot at playing on Adelaide Oval, but first time as a, as a Port Adelaide player. How excited are you about that? Yeah, really excited. Um, heard a lot about um, you know the atmosphere there. Um, as far as the Port Port Adelaide people are concerned, so um, I'm just looking forward to getting out there and um, you know just really hearing the crowd get behind the boys. Nice, thanks very much, buddy. Thanks, man.